Hi, Earth Signs. My name is Debbie, and I'm an intuitive reader. And I'm here today to give you guys your bonus reading for the Earth Signs out there. Uh, guys, please take the time to smash that like button, share, comment down below, as well as subscribe if you haven't already. Also, the link down below for my happening Putting Back the Pieces book that I personally wrote with personal stories in there uh, is down there also if interested in purchasing. So we are going to get started. Hope you guys are doing well here. We're going to start off first. <clears throat> yeah, the voice is already gone. I was out singing last night at karaoke. Sorry about that. Uh, but it was so much fun. Uh, we're going to start off first for the sign of Taurus here. Let's get cracking. Spirit, what does, what does a sign of Taurus need to know? Spirit. Hmm. That's a tough one. I may have to pull another one. This is very specific here. Exactly. All right. So I feel that somebody feels, yeah, exactly. Okay. This is really personal, really upfront there in regards to somebody in particular. Somebody just feels blah. Somebody feels totally stuck in their life. Uh, they feel like they need justice in their life here. They think they feel that they need things to turn around in the better here. They, they uh, there could be some kind of court thing as well. That's a little side thing, but really what I'm feeling here is in regards to you just feel stuck and you just want your life to start improving is what I'm feeling here. You can do it. You have to be the one that moves forward. I literally heard for that change. That Ace of Pentacles is heading right towards you're in solitude. I just heard solitude. So somebody is not, they're staying home. They're being home by, I get it. I, I totally get that. I, I myself went through that phase. I get it. But the Ace plus the four is five of pentacles and that's a slow procedure so you have to slowly but surely get it's almost kind of like a depression is what i'm feeling you slowly have to get it out there and adventure into life here you have to basically with the eight of wands right after that you got to get out of that phase you have to push yourself you have to make yourself get out there again in life again uh but it's very i heard solitude you have to get out there and adventure out you're the one that makes the decision to whether or not you want your life to be justified, meaning to improve things, I feel, okay? So that's very, very direct for somebody out there who needs to know what's going on here as to how do I get out of this funk, it feels like. That answer is you have to make yourself move forward, get out of the bed. Believe me, I've been depressed myself. I totally get it. I my, I lost my son. He was a full-term stillborn. You know, there's details. It's actually in the book. <laughs> if you want more information with that. Uh, but yeah, I, I've been also with that, you know, with depression. So I get it. But you have to make yourself spirit saying, get out of that funk. You have to be the one that 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 goes with the flow here. Let's pull extra here because that was definitely just meant for a handful out there. What else for Taurus? Please, guys, please take the time to timestamp even a special message for Taurus, meaning that second message here. Okay. So you have the judgment, Taurus. That's good. And it's looking over at the magician. So that tells me that they're clarifying that... Uh, you know, what you're thinking, what you're manifesting, they hear it, uh, that's good. You know, you want that energy here. Uh, definitely, I feel that they, you know, they're helping you along your way here. You have a new goal in mind. Could be with job as well, with Ace of Pentacles. You could be not happy. You're manifesting for an improvement in regards to work here. But overall, balance some feeling. Let's continue on. You're getting yourself stuck. You want a relationship as well, you feel divine timing stepping in with this with the nine plus the two of cups. When I have matching elements like this, they make me add, subtract, what have you with this. So definitely, I feel that you are manifesting for a relationship to develop because you feel that strong connection, getting out of that stuck energy to start anew of new balance. So multiple messages for Taurus, not just for that specific person about that depression I felt, but I also feel in regards to job, somebody is stuck at a job. I feel that that will definitely uh, come about. The Two of Cups is known for a relationship, yes, but in regards to job, money, that's a commitment. And as we all know, jobs are committed. We are, you know, to some degree required to make, to, to live in this world. That's a commitment. And your wishes are coming true for that improvement, I feel, Taurus. All right, that's cool. Rock it on. 
All right, let's move on to Virgo. Ooh. Lack of communication, things coming to a close. You got the Ten of Swords as well as the uh, Ten of Wands here. So it's going to take a little bit more time, but I feel there's finally progression. You're coming to an end of a chapter. They make that known perfectly clear with two tens. That tens are known for a completion of a lack of communication, heading towards, you know, approaching this communication, approaching this action with the sword energy, with the wand energy. That's what I'm feeling in regards to communication and showing the action slowly but surely. There's going to be more movement. There's finally movement. It's kind of like, uh, I'm trying to think of an example. It's kind of like uh, when there's a delay on a plane and everybody's on the plane, right? And all the passengers are like, why aren't we moving? Well, there's a technical issue. So we all have to sit there and wait. Sometimes they boot us off, but if it's a quickie, they fix it there and everybody sits quietly, you know? Uh, but it's like you're on a delay. That's what it feels like. But you're, but it's going to eventually slowly move down that runway, you know? Uh, there's going to be movement. You're heading towards your wish fulfillment in regards to love. Nicely put there, spirit. Love when they give me scenarios. <laughs> uh, thank you, Virgo. And Capricorn. Sorry for the ice maker, Capricorn. <laughs> I love my ice. Capricorn. Oh. This one wants to come out. Very confused in regards to an option, in regards to a relationship. What I'm feeling is that somebody is just totally lost. What happened here? I don't know what happened, you know. Uh, there is some kind of ignoring, snubbing, lack of communication, I feel. Uh, with the King of Pentacles, you could be dealing with another Capricorn, a Virgo, or... Um uh, yeah, I just went blank Taurus here, but I do feel that definitely, you know, somebody is basically not paying attention to this uh, relationship here. I feel it's the opposing person, which could be you. Absolutely. Uh, they are your wish fulfillment. They're making me add the seven plus the two there. There's the nine of cups. So they are your wish fulfillment in regards to possibly a soulmate. Uh, relationship here, but I do feel it's kind of like, well, what just happened? Like it just suddenly uh, dropped off the face of the world here, uh, but they're not paying attention to you right now, I feel. Let's continue on. Yeah. I feel that they're trying to get the Kahugas, basically. You could be dealing with a Leo here with the Strength card. Uh, but they're trying to figure, uh, they are balanced, okay? They do know what they want, I feel. But they're kind of intimidated. I just heard intimidated with their thoughts as to how to get you back, how to go on the right path, how to approach you kind of thing. That's what it feels like to me. Because they're trying to have that encouragement, but they don't know how you're going to react. So, uh, you know, I feel that they have to have that encouragement first to speak. They are coming back, I feel. Uh, you got two eights here, so... Um, for some, not all, it could be eight days. Eight is very significant with this, with the uh, strength card being the eight, as well as the eight of sorts here. So definitely I feel that eight is very significant. Could be in eight days from now, like I was saying, eight weeks, eight months. I'm not feeling the months. I'm feeling either eight days, eight weeks. But regardless, I feel that there's definitely, that's what's stopping them. But I do feel that they will have that strength to communicate towards you and pay attention in regards to this relationship once again. And that's what I have for Capricorn as well for all the earth signs out there. You guys rock. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Have a great day and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.